Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we have an intriguing topic to discuss that has been making waves in the financial world. We are going to talk about the recent statements from Intel Guru Marx and Newshound Guru Caperoni regarding the potential revaluation, or RV, of currencies. So, let's dive right in. Recently, Intel Guru Marx shared some thoughts on when we might expect the RV plane to land. He expressed a sense of caution about making predictions, stating that he feels extremely upbeat but doesn't want to contribute to the already volatile nature of this topic. This statement was made on May 24, 2024. Marx's hesitation to make a definitive prediction highlights the unpredictable nature of currency revaluation and the roller coaster experience investors have been facing. It's important to understand that the RV is a complex process influenced by various economic factors, making it difficult to pinpoint an exact timeline. Now, let's shift our focus to newshound Guru K. Peroni. He has been addressing concerns surrounding the concept of a float and its potential impact on speculation within the country. Many float articles have raised alarms about the risk of speculators manipulating the market. However, Caperoni reassures that such speculation is unlikely to happen within the country. Understanding the mechanics of a float is crucial. In a floating exchange rate system, the value of a currency is determined by the market forces of supply and demand relative to other currencies. This system can lead to significant fluctuations, which is why concerns about speculation arise. Speculators can potentially exploit these fluctuations for profit, leading to instability. However, Caperoni's analysis suggests that these fears might be overblown. He argues that the regulatory frameworks and controls in place are designed to prevent such speculative activities within the country. This means that, while market dynamics will play a role, the likelihood of rampant speculation of disrupting the system is minimized. Let's break down what this means for potential investors. The reassurance from Caperoni can provide some peace of mind. It suggests that while the market will experience natural fluctuations, the systemic risk posed by speculators is controlled. This is a crucial point for anyone considering investments tied to the RV. Now, bringing these perspectives together, what can we infer about the future of the RV? Marx's cautious optimism and Caperoni's analytical approach both point towards a future where the RV is possible but not without its challenges. The key takeaway here is the importance of being informed and understanding the complexities involved. For those new to the concept of currency revaluation, it's essentially an adjustment of a country's official exchange rate. This can be done to improve economic conditions by making exports more competitive or to address inflation. The RV can lead to significant changes in a country's economy and can attract a lot of attention from investors looking to capitalize on these shifts. However, it's crucial to approach this with a level-headed mindset. The financial landscape is fraught with uncertainties, and while expert insights like those from Marx and Caperoni are valuable, they are not guarantees. It's important to do thorough research and consider multiple perspectives before making any investment decisions. In conclusion, the potential for an RV is an exciting prospect but it comes with its fair share of challenges and uncertainties. Intel Guru Marx's cautious optimism and newshound Guru Caperoni's reassurances about speculation provide valuable insights into what we might expect. As always, stay informed and approach any investment opportunities with a well-rounded understanding of the risks and rewards involved. Thank you for tuning in. If you found this video helpful, Please like and subscribe for more updates and insights. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, stay financially savvy. See you in the next video.